know, damn creaks can happen anywhere on your bike. Uh, especially seat posts. They're the most prone places to have creaks and crocks and pops and stuff. Um, if you take the time and uh, just go through your bike a little toothbrush um, sometimes you can take all the creaks and pops out of your bike because this one's got some sand in there and it just moans and groans and pops and goes on you so I haven't done this for a while to this bike but I've never done it actually and never had to until I recently rode it because just to check it all over it's my uh, it's the Norco site uh, e-bike I had to ride it the other day because the Laufey is sick still and uh, took it for a spin and boy the first their first initial couple pedals on it it just starts creaking and creaking and creaking and it doesn't let up I'm like oh I gotta put up with this the whole ride so I said to myself I'm gonna have to get rid of that so I've uh, I'm gonna put some grease around here and I'm gonna Make sure all the pops and greases are out of it. So, so you don't want that happening too much. Man, you gotta see these things. I got a blue one and a red one. Uh, I think they're kind of technically for a motorcycle chain that motorcycles have chains on their motorcycles anyhow uh they're amazing on your bicycle too by the way they got little bristles on the end and they got a three bristles here right so i've been using the red one and uh it will clean the chain you can just gotta make it work down in there let me show you you can see that or not but yeah you can set it inside there and rush it up and down it's pretty awesome and then something else i discovered with it i want to show you so you know how your driller bogey wheels get all dirty check this out you stick it fits right on the derailleur like that and look how nice and easy that is cleans up all your your bogey wheels on your derailleur and it cleans the chain in there and you can do the upper one too it just sits in there like that and you pedal it around and this end just gets in your kind of in, in your gears and stuff right in your cassette right in the lower ones and stuff right it just helps you pick out all the fine shit out of there but yeah man they're, it's amazing Gets in all the little tight spots whenever you need it, right? Cleans it, make sure it's all cleaned up. Stick free, grease free, crap free, you know. Handy little tools, you can pick them up. It's like, I got the red one and the blue one for like 14 bucks off of Amazon. I'm like, you can't go wrong. I'm like, it would sit right over the, over this, and it would just, you pedal it and... You do the top of the chain, you can do bottom of the chain, whatever. Get it all nice and clean. You can put some soap in there and brush them all, get it all nice and clean. It gets on all the little spots. You just hold it different direct ways, right? Over to one side, you can get all the face of the chain all clean. I mean, it's endless, endless possibilities with this thing. It's neat. I'm really surprised. I'm really happy I bought this. So, Amazon two pack for like fourteen bucks, fifteen bucks. So what? 
one more step to making it easier to keep your drag train clean, right? Like, you gotta get it. When I seen them, like, I was a little hesitant, but once I, I tried it, man, it was just crazy awesome. So, yeah. Utilizing something that's for something else, make it your own. Right? Isn't that awesome? So, there you have it, guys. Get you one of these. And then you're set. Especially if you get a chain and you're off road on your mountain bike, like the Norco in the back or my Arbea, and it's dirty and grimy. You got to get one of these. And you got to take care of all the creaks and pops. You got to get all that dirt and sand out of your uh, clamps off your seat posts. That's where it comes from, right? You got to move that seat post up, undo it, slide it up, and get all that sand and crap out of there. Because it'll be just a nonsense ride the whole time. It'll drive you nuts. You know? It's just crazy. The little things that push your buttons, I guess. If you like a silent bike, you know, you don't want to ride it. and You just got to maintain the, the other parts of it, too. And these are just all little things that will help you along your, along your ride. So if you're finding pops and creaks, and, uh, things are making noises where you don't want to make noise. And they normally, they shouldn't. But you got little fine sand particles in there and you got to move things around and get the get the sand out so guys have a great day it's raining outside i can't get out to pedal so i might as well got these from amazon today and i was like i gotta try this thing out so i was trying it out and all of a sudden bam just clicked these things are awesome even if it is a farm motorcycle who cares man it works on the derailleur it works on the boogie wheels it's difficult to get those clean without power washing them off or soaping them and clean them for hours when it would take like seconds to clean those wheels off so guys think outside the box and go for it I tried it and it worked I got Lucky, I guess. Have a great day. Catch you in the next one. Like, share, and subscribe, guys. Take care. Take advantage of the rain days because you get to clean the chain now. So bye for now.